welcome back family welcome back i am back here right here on my big comfy couch here at cena's dolls and who you are looking at she is from my lee militant collection and i wanted you guys to see her and she is my guest audience um, audience member for this video she is a beautiful beautiful um african-american skin tone with the the type of wig she has on is the um kinky twist like a kinky twist type wig which is really adorable fits her she has beautiful brown eyes and her lips are like the sweet lip sculpt so she may be a, a sweet lip sculpt and this is a um Ariva baby Reva is her um, sculptor and she is all dressed in her Valentine's outfit. Her shirt says love and she has these really pretty plaid pants on with these little cute black shoes with the black bow and the white lining around it. And she's all ready for Valentine's Day like I stated in my other videos that i am getting some dolls in my collection already dressed for valentine's day because if i do not do it now then they probably won't get dressed dressed up for the holiday so i do have to start early say hello she's going to be with us in this video but this video is not about her oh look how cute it is we're gonna bring our attention over this direction which I am going to get her back in the video to this little sleepy head give me a few moments to get my sweet girl back into the camera can we see her yes there we go all right and who we are looking at here is my baby Onyx. I named him Onyx. He is the Jude skull by Olga Re um what's her last name <laughs> by Olga Ria. I think that's right. Um not sure but it's the Jude scope and I'm going to do a quick changing video with him and depending upon how long it takes me to change him, I, I have another baby here that I want to get changed as well. I am going to be putting him on this newborn koala kid. This is Heartbreaker here. And this is going to be his little Valentine's little outfit with the socks. And what else I have for him? Oh, I might put him on this little baby cat hat hat here so we will see we will see but I wanted to g give you guys a little detail video on him and also he will be leaving my nursery just for a few just for a short period of time he's going over there to his auntie Lynn over there at Villa Blessing he's going to go spend time over there with her so I wanted to get um get him in the camera and i wanted you guys to meet him before he um goes to visit his auntie so bring him closer take a look at him he has this gorgeous gorgeous hair just to let you know his um artist who created him who painted him in this beautiful skin tone and rooted all this gorgeous hair is uni reborn dad he um painted him I actually bought little onyx here on the second market okay his um daddy actually his daddy who uh, actually had him custom made for himself and he requested for him to have this beautiful hair hair the way it is 
and um what it is the story of this hair is it's a it's a birthmark it's actually a birthmark some children are born with white hair in the front and i didn't know that at the time when i first saw this little baby i did not know that the white hair was a replica of children that um were born with this birthmark so i did some research and pulled up a few pictures and i you know i was surprised to see that you know there are children that that are born with um with the white hair so that was something that i've learned and i didn't know so that was awesome and um that's what he has this beautiful bar birthmark not only that this hair is like the softest hair i have ever felt on um a baby a reborn and it is rooted really nicely in this thick but it's also soft and he is a baby boy that has a lot of hair i remember my son was born with more hair than my daughter's i mean just a lot of hair so he kind of remind me of that type of baby boy that just has a, a lot of hair so um he has beautiful rooted eyelashes he has beautiful glossed lips his hands are nicely well not his hands his nails are nicely tipped his hands is just painted beautifully let's see if we get that in there he did a really good job on him look at the bottom of his feet very realistic he has mottling on his leg i don't know if the camera is picking that up he put him on this beautiful brown um chest stitch and bottom stitch body and he made him very very floppy so you do have to hold his head or he's he's gonna fall because there's not a lot of filling in this area which is how i like him because it's very realistic he has on this beautiful look beautiful this nice diaper that has peace signs on here and i know i got this diaper in a box opening from um miss serenity smith so i put this on him and we're just gonna get little onyx dress today in his heartbreaker shirt so i didn't have any pants for him because i want his legs out so we're not going to put any pants on him today we're just going to have him on this um long sleeve onesie and some socks and i might keep him on that hat we'll see how that goes look at him look <laughs> just sleek looking up at his well not looking up but head facing up he is so adorable this sculpt is so realistic looking um and then the painting his painting is very realistic he is like one of the favorites in my nursery and he's considered one of the um newer babies um, that I received the last few months so I only dressed him I will say like twice and took pictures of him so I have not handled him a lot since I've um, since I've got him so I said let me take let me do a video with him so his family in the YouTube community could take a look at him and dote over how cute he is he is a cutie pie and his, let me show you guys the front part of his feet i like how he did the um the creasings on him and this um pretty brown skin tone 
So I'm going to put him on these gray and red and blue socks that matches his onesie. See this all that in the camera? Move it back some. Okay. All right. So I'm going to brush his hair down some. I'm just going to spray a little bit of this water on this baby brush. Just to lay his bang down, his bangs <laughs> in the front. He looks like a um, one of those little um, 70s babies hairstyle like a like those band like one of those band members that had hair like this in the 70s that's what it reminds me of <laughs> yes so let me brush it down some and i really like how his lips are how his lips are glossed and um his long lashes Can I see him? Look how adorable he is. Let's see how his head just falls. He has one bald fist here and open hands on this side. And he is truly a heart breaker. And I'm going to miss him when he leaves. I am going to miss him, but I know that his Auntie Lynn is going to have him on the camera and send me plenty of pictures of him so I know that for sure so let's see how this hat looks I like hats on him because I like to see his hair out in the front like this this is a baby gap hat baby gap hat and um it's cute on him. I like to see his hair out. Let me see. Let me get my brush. See, his hair just falls in place. Falls in place. How cute. Let's put your face this way so you can see in the camera. Look at him. He is just so adorable. This is baby Onyx. Baby Onyx. Hello, aunties. So this is all of my um have him on. Just these socks with his legs out. His cute little heartbreak long sleeve onesie. And this cute little baby gap hat. And he is all dressed. I'm going to take him some pictures in this because he looks so adorable. All right. So I think that I'm going to end this video. I will come back with another baby. Um, I don't want to um, dress the other baby that I had in this video because I am tired from work today. Today they got that salary out of me. Do you hear me? They worked me today. So I am sleepy. They got every penny out of me. <laughs> that they're paying out of me today. So um, this is going to be um, the video just with these two sweethearts. And I will be back with another video. Be safe. Be blessed and thank you all for subscribing and showing me all the love, myself and my beautiful dolls. And we will be back with another video.